Hello fellow engineers and welcome back to Dungeon Crawler. Yes, the full game is here, so let's get involved. We'll start a new run in slot three and we'll have a little look at the characters. Oh, we've got some unlockable ones. But since for this one we need to amass over 500 coins in one run, let's go back to my favorite character of this, which was Scrappy. So if you never saw this, this was basically one of the like most addictive games I played last year. And basically down the bottom, it plays like a turn-based battler, but up the top, it plays like one of those grab games. And depending on what item you get, that's like what you do. So you either, if you grab a sword, that will do damage to these guys. If you can grab a shield, that will block the damage. Because you can see up here, this one's going to do four damage three times in a row and then this one behind is going to do 10 damage as well so we either need to try and take both of these out or we need to get a lot of shielding now if you hover over here each small shield increases block by five but a big shield can block 10 let's try and grab the big shield here I mean, if we can get a little shield as well, that will not be bad. Oh, we also got a dagger as well. Cheeky bit of damage we can do that. So they go down here as they come out. Boosh, bit of damage. And then we got 15 shield. Uh, now this one, this is a this is a magnet. So this can only pick up the metal items in here. And you'll notice the, the shields, they're made out of wood. That's a little wood icon down there. All the swords... They're made out of metal, hence the bolt icon. So if we go like there, we are oh, we picked up all of those. We should take out the first guy, I think. So ready? Boosh, boosh, boosh. And then a bit of attack to the second one. We've got the block. So we blocked his entire attack. And now he's got to take out 14 damage. And we are good. So let's go down there. Grab those. Yes, we got the big sword. So boosh, loads of damage down. And that is you out of there. Then we get to pick a reward. So these basically get added to the pot or at least a chance of getting them. So I reckon let's get a sickle because that will do 15 damage and has a 50% chance to deal a critical hit, which deals 1.5 times damage. And by the way, if you want to win this game yourself, be sure to sign up to my newsletter because the developers have given me five Steam keys to give away for this game. And if you signed up to my newsletter and you vote in the poll of the last week's newsletter in the archive, you'll be entered into the prize draw where you might just win. All right, then we move along here to the next level. And then I'm thinking we try and get the big shield. So, oh no, we missed it. No. I mean, we got enough shield to shield against the first attack or maybe the second one. If we can do 26 damage, we might be in trouble here. Unless I can try and go like there and maybe magnet the big sword as well. Yes, yes, we got it. Oh, I thought it didn't work for a second, but it did work. But it fell in. No, it fell the wrong way. Oh, we took out the first guy anyway. Oh, nice. Okay, so we didn't actually take any damage then because our shield blocked us. Uh, these guys are going to do a combined 17 damage. This first one also has some block. So I reckon try and block ourselves. I mean, if we can get the sickle and the big shield, yes, that will be very useful. All right, so since we can't actually grab a shield, I think let's just go over here. Try and do as much damage as possible. As long as they actually fall into the hole this time. Yes, they do. Boosh, boosh, boosh. So that front guy's down. We've got enough block to shield against that. And then I'm going to do similar as before. Try and grab these with just the claw. Seeing that the health goes down like that. Oh, and because it did a critical, jobs are good. And so pick a reward. Spiky shield sounds quite good. Increases your block by three, but gives you five spikes. They do damage the attacker when being attacked. But then there's this one, which is a slightly rarer one. The brass knuckles. Attacks for two and then gives you a dodge as well. Let's take that. Right, then we get to play one of these machines where we get a reward. It's an alchemist coupon. So we get a free item from the alchemist when we visit there or increase our critical hit damage by 20%. Now, since the sickle does criticals, I think that probably could pay off in the long run. Anyway, now we're on the next level. So shall I, shall I go get a new perk first? Probably should. So we'll do another one of these and then, oh, there you go. Increases critical hit chance by 100% when you have less than 30% health. I mean, oh, I don't like going low health in this game. So the other one, if you only pick a single item in a turn, it gets used twice. That could be fantastic, although not with the magnet. But at least my first run, that could be very good. Let's try it. All right, over to the left, we have a different type of claw machine. So this one will give us money. I think aim for the pigs. So there's a load of pigs and coins. We don't need any hearts, so we can ignore those. Oh, we did drop a coin. Still a load of cash. And then we can take on the boss. So this guy is going to buff itself. So I think for now, try and go for attacks, right? So if I try and go down there, 
grab... I mean, we've got two swords. Not that bad. But this thing does have 152 damage. All right, and the magnet, we go this side. Grab all of those things. As long as they all fall down the hole, that should be quite a lot of damage. Oh, we got a nice little critical there. All right, so next round, this thing has been buffed. So it has spikes. So when we hurt it, we get hurt now. But uh, I'm going to go here, try and grab the big shield as well as the sickle. Oh, no, we flung it. We flung it. <laughs> I mean, we got a little shield. But because we took spike damage, we've only got two block now. So... We really need to try and take out that very nice, nice amount of health. Yeah, let's go there. I mean, maybe we can... Oh, no, I was hoping we'd get more than that. That is rubbish. Okay, we're taking a hit now. Ow, we lost six health. Right, pretty aggressive grab. Boosh, boosh, boosh. It's got four health remaining. So let's just go there. Hopefully we get two daggers. Yes, we do. So that is the boss down. All right, then we get to pick one rare reward. Ooh, these are all quite good. Poisonous weapons. We got dodgy. Each time you dodge an attack, deal 10 damage to the attacker. So that will work well with my brass knuckles. Or then gain 20 health. Let's try the dodgy one. Sounds interesting. All right, and then up here, got to pick one of these doors. Let's go left for now. So we've got the blacksmith here so we can upgrade some of our stuff. So the brass knuckles, if I spend 15 quid, will become the brass knuckle plus... So that gives me two dodge, which could work out quite nicely. Yeah, and they all cost 15. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, we'll do the brass knuckle anyway. All right, then down here, we can actually lose some stuff from our deck if we wanted to. I mean, since you got the magnet, I'm tempted to keep more like magnetic stuff in there. Although I think there's a limit. I think I can only do 10. Okay, so we can only do one. So we'll shred one thing, get a tenner back. Then in the alchemist... Oh, we can change the material. Oh, so we could make like the good shield. We could make it metal if we had 15 quid. Oh, no, I just realized I just realized what I did. The shredding cost me. It didn't give me money. It cost me. <laughs> oh, idiot. <laughs> oh, no. Anyway, next battle. These guys are going to be doing quite a bit of damage to me. So it might be worth trying to get the golden knuckle dusters, which we have. That will give us a load of dodge. So we dodged two attacks. So, I mean, if we can do 13 damage this time, we are laughing. So let's get these four daggers. Yes, it's no sickle, but I think it should be enough. Oh, we nearly got the sickle as well. Did you see it jump up there? Anyway, boosh, boosh. That's down. You're not down, but the dodge should mean, yes, we're safe. So now we go all out attack. So I think we go there, drop that in, boosh. And then with this, we go to the sickle end. And that is another win. All right, then we'll grab the Ring of Strength. Increases your strength by two. That's how much damage you do, like, on top. So that will increase all the damage we do by two. So lovely. Uh, we've got an attack straight ahead. We've also got a mystery room over here. I think... Let's go to the mystery room afterwards, just in case we need cash. All right, I'll try and get the Ring of Strength down there. Have we got it? I think we got it. So now you can see down here, we got two strength. So every time we do an attack, we'll do extra damage. So this could be a really good hit, actually. We might be able to completely take out this first enemy. Nice. Oh, second one has poisonous gas. So we need to take it out at the end of this turn if we can. So we'll grab the sickle. Just about got it through. Boosh. Oh, that was a critical hit. Nice. Ooh, look at this. Battery. If submerged in liquid, electrifies all metal items in a small radius, causing them to deal 10% of their damage. That's decent. But we don't have water yet. So I think just go for the sickle. And then we'll go to the mystery room. Oh no, we take five damage when collecting these. But these have mystery perks in them. Okay, I've got to try and not collect any... Oh no, that's, that's 10. Is that 10 damage? Let's see if these are worthwhile. What's in them? I don't know. I don't think I want to take more damage. Let's end our turn. <laughs> So what did we get? Sw oh, no. I should have taken the battery thing. <laughs> I mean, I can skip it, but it's probably quite good because it means all the wooden stuff will float. Oh, I just wish I took the battery now. Anyway, another mystery room. Ooh, ooh, what are these? So mystery chests have a random item when collected. These gold ones are a rare one. Okay, so we want to try and get the rare. So let's go there-ish, please. Yes, we got two. We got two. I'll take that. So we can pick... Oh, we get both of these. So we get more brass knuckles and we get a war hammer. A metal item that does 15 damage and 10 block. Lovely jubbly. Right, we've got a reward over there. Because that will heal me, I might take on the boss first. The Knight Commander of the Order of Defender Lot. Oh, damn! So, oh, 20% water isn't a lot, actually. It's done almost nothing. <laughs> I might grab these brass knuckles. 
I mean, really, I want the ring, really. I just don't think I can get the ring from here. I'll try. Please. Oh, it fell out. It fell out. We got shields, which are pointless. Um. Anyway, then we'll go here. I can see two sickles as well as the big sword. Oh, this could do some damage. This could do some damage. He's got 211 health, though. So we'll see how it does. If we get a critical, we might be good. No, he's upgraded. So oh, he always keeps his block. And he's going to gain some block as well as do 19 damage to me. So as long as I get one brass knuckle, we should be fine. I'm going to go there to try and get the sickle and the ring. Now the ring's way down still. Ooh, 27 damage. And then we go this way. I think if we get the brass knuckles, we should dodge his attack. So fall in, fall in. Oh, you stupid sword. <laughs> still, hopefully we dodge his 19 damage. Yes, we do. And then we go again. So I reckon let's try and get these two. I mean, hopefully we can knock that brass knuckle in. Oh, no. I mean, we got we got the one sickle, so that will do double damage because of that perk we picked up earlier. Um, I think if we take them, that should be enough damage to end this. And yes, we knock the knuckles in. So we dodge his attack, whatever happens. Buddy's down. Um, ooh, blacksmith coupon. You can upgrade one item for free. Is that better than critical hit chance by 10%? I think I've got to go criticals. We're going criticals. All right, then we're going back here to the reward. So we should be able to heal ourselves a little bit. But really, I just want piggies because that is money. So let's go there. Hopefully you can get a cheeky heart. No, it fell out. It fell out. Still, a load of cash. Getting closer to that 500 we need for the new character. Uh, let's go to the blacksmith. So go to the blacksmith first. So, oh, we can upgrade the strength ring. So we get an extra four damage for every attack. I think that's worthwhile. I got 25 coins. I'm thinking about turning that ring into like a metal. So let's leave that. We'll go to the alchemist. Go to the coin. Turn it into metal. Cost 16 quid. But then we can magnet it up. Boosh. All right, then we got a hard fight there or a hard fight here plus a mystery room. So we'll go that way. There's a lot of people that want to hurt me here. So <laughs> I think we sort of need the brass knuckles. So if I go there, can... Oh, no, I missed them. We got a sickle. It will do double damage at least. Boosh, boosh. Then if I go there, I mean, we can get the hammer as well, which is a load of block. Oh, no, we... No! The magnet wasn't strong enough. I mean, we took out the first. Oh, we took out the second enemy as well. We are going to take 20 damage, though. That's because we weren't able to get any brass knuckles. Oh, that was so silly. Anyway, we'll go there. We do have some brass knuckles this time. This guy's not attacking this time, though. Great. Anyway, we go there. So we get the ring again. We hopefully get the big sword and the war hammer. The sword's not going to make it in again. But it's okay because he's down. Ooh, we got some purples. You can use an additional tentacle claw next turn. The tentacles spread out when they are submerged in liquid. Ooh. When it says next turn, is that every turn or just next turn? Let's try it. Oh, it's probably an item I actually need to collect, isn't it? Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, I've got the tentacles now. Ugh. Ugh. All right, so do I get the piggy and the health or do I try and get the rare mystery chest? I think we go health. Okay. Oh, man. Quite a lot stuck to us there. That's a lot of health. Each one was 10. I mean, we got max health. So that's good, at least. Anyway, another mystery one. Oh, loads of coins. And we've got the magnet thing. Okay. So let's go there. Oh, man. So much. Oh, we're going to take so much damage. Oh, no. Oh, no. Look how many came through. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> Down to 75 health. Definitely did those the wrong way around. Anyway, we've got a normal battle now. Uh, let's try. I don't know if I can get these brass knuckles. I'll try and get these brass knuckles. No, I've dropped them. I've got the tentacle thing. Nope, we haven't even got that. Balls. All right, well, this time I need dodge and attack. So if we go there. Come on, stay in, stay in, stay in. No, we, we lost one. Oh, no. It's okay, it's okay. First enemy's down. Okay, we're going to take one damage because we had the block. Oh, no, I think we had two dodge, didn't we? Because we got the gold brass knuckles, which is two dodge. It's just that one that's one dodge. Okay, so we probably can end this if we just get one sickle. Boosh. All right, what do we want to add now? I reckon probably the battle axe. I mean, the lava's not terrible because it means the fluff turns into burning fluff. So all the fluff in there will do two damage. But the battle axe does 15 damage and removes the enemy's block. So you definitely go for that. All right, then we get to pick between a boss. Now, I think in the in the demo, we did this boss, Mathilda. So let's go down and see what this guy is like. Uh, first off, though, let's head to the mystery room. Maybe we can get some health. Oh, no, we can get health, but we can also get hurt as well. Okay, let's go there. 
There's three spikes coming down, but four bits of health. So maybe it will pay off. Okay, we're up to 95 health and we got one of those rewards, a water pistol. All right, then there's another reward thing. So let's just try and get some coins from the piggies. And then we're ready to take on this boss. 400 health, Woolworth the Blubarian. Okay, so I think we just want damage, right? It's a nice dagger and an axe, not bad. Then with this one, we go like there-ish. Hopefully we can get the sword. Oh, that wasn't that wasn't very good actually. <laughs> Still, we took we took like 60 health off him. What perks he got? War cry. Double strength at the end of every turn. Oh no, he's got four strength already. Well, that's not good. Okay, we definitely need to try and get dodges. So if I go there, we can maybe get the brass knuckles and the ring. We drop the brass knuckles. We got the ring though, so we've got strength ourselves. Now if we use this to get those knuckles and get the big sword underneath as well. Please knuckles, don't don't fall the wrong way knuckles. Oh, they didn't fall anyway. <laughs> no. So we're taking damage out. Okay, right. Let's get the big shield, the big sword. Hopefully we can knock the knuckles in. There we go. So at least we definitely dodge means we can aim for full-on attackage. So let's go there. Because this way, we've got the ring as well, which means we do extra damage in the future. And yes, we are working through the health. He's down to 180. He missed us with his attack. He's going to do 32 damage, 16 extra strength. We need brass knuckles every time. Quick. Yes, they're in. They're in. All right. Now I reckon we go there. Maybe we can get the sickle as well. Not quite. Anyway, that should be enough to maybe take him down. No, he's still got 62 health. Oh, and as we just got one knuckle there, it should be doubled. And it means he's down. Nice. So for reward, oh, we can heal after each fight. That sounds good. We could also start with spikes or we can get an alchemist coupon. So that's worth like 15 coins. Oh, I do actually I quite like the sound of that, actually. Yeah, we'll take that. Um, so we could go to the alchemist. I feel like I'd rather go left to the blacksmith, though. So what do we want to upgrade? I think our other knuckles cost 17 quid. Boosh. And then perhaps the battle axe, because that means we do 25 damage, which is huge. All right, now we go up here where we can gamble. So it costs five quid to play, but it gives us a chance of getting body armor. We've just got to make it land in this thing. And let's play. So where do we want to drop this? Can we drop it right down the side? Yeah, we can. Oh, no, it doesn't even go to the side. Oh, no. Okay, we go again. We go again. So down the middle. Please, please, please. Yes, we got it. Body armor. So we got a quick battle first. So, ooh, magnet claw. You can use an additional magnet claw next turn. The honey ball would have been good if there wasn't water at the bottom of our thing. I think we'll take the magnet claw. Right, and then what is going on here? We've got like a, we've got like a harpoon. I think we need to try and shoot the chest without shooting a harpoon maybe so oh we got the harpoon we got the piranha as well so is the piranha gonna hurt us no nothing happened with the piranha we got the chest nice inside a dark sword deals 25 damage but lose two health for each item that gets picked up at the same turn oh no i might skip that because with my magnet we pick up a lot of items i don't think the dark sword is worth it uh, something that is worth it though risking health for coins <laughs> right loads and loads of coins oh loads and loads of damage as well though ow 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 okay so we got a battle here oh look there's a magnet there let's try and get the magnet for next turn okay we missed it fair enough <laughs> if we go there that should do quite a lot of damage i think the the golden axe is pretty good we've also got the ring as well so one guy's down Oh, guy at the back has the mirror again. So we need to try and get a dodge. Please don't drop. Yes, we got it. Ooh, worth noting there's poison spores in here. You receive three poison if you collect this. Well, hopefully they're not magnetic. Yeah, so you can just pick around the poison stuff. Oh, why did they fall the wrong way? It's not fair. Life isn't fair, buddy. Um, ooh, magic wand. Does five damage to the last en enemy, but it heals you as well. I think that's quite essential. We can also make it make it metal at some point. Um, we're not going to do the Mathilda boss fights. We'll go down to this boss fight. We'll do a reward first. Oh, no. Gambling health for coins once again. I think let's go down this way. Oh, we've got so many. Oh, no. We're going to lose so much health. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, we're down to 24 health. Hopefully over this way we can heal. Yes, we can, as long as we can collect them. So here's probably the best bet. Please get three. Okay, that will heal us 30, I think. Yeah, okay, we're up to 54. 
Just what you want before a boss. All right, so this boss is going to add items to the machine, which is probably not going to be good for us. Um, don't really know what to go for. I guess try and get some of the... Oh, we got nothing. We got nothing. Oh, well, in that case, I think we go down here where we got the most chance of doing damage. Yes, the sickle fell in. So he's down to 330 health. What has he added? These things. Explodes and deals 10 damage if it's not removed from the machine. It's made out of metal though, so I should be able to get both of those. So for now, maybe I'll go this way and try and get the healing and the brass knuckles. Yes, that was a good throw. That was a good throw. So we healed a little bit. We got to dodge. So now we try and get both those bombs out. I think the bombs also do 20 damage. Oh, we dropped both of them. What? <laughs> Come on, Magda. I mean, we've got loads of dodge. So maybe... Oh, no. I was going to say, maybe we won't take the damage. We took the damage. Right. I really need to heal. I'm not sure I'm going to be able to, though. I could try and get the healing wand. We've got to try, haven't we? Oh, have I got it? Yes, I've got it. I've got it. Okay, we can heal a little bit. Does it heal us by 10? It healed us by 8. I think it's between 5 and 10, isn't it? Okay, so this one will just do damage and get the brass knuckles. Okay, I think we're safe. I think we're safe. At least we can't die this turn. And he's not adding any more bombs in, so that's good. He's doing three attacks this turn, so we could use double brass knuckle. I'm going to try and get the healing thing again, just because you can't really heal any other time unless you get lucky with, like, the mini games. We're up to 38 health. If we get the double brass knuckle, then we're laughing. Oh, no. Oh, we lost. No. Oh, we didn't get any brass knuckles. We got 10 block. We're down to three health. Oh, no. All right, get the healing. Get the healing, please. We got the healing, not the axe. Oh, does it get doubled? It gets doubled. Okay, we're up to 21 health. Now we just want to do damage. So I think let's go there-ish. We could maybe end this if all of these actually fall in. I mean, not many fell in. I won't like. Is he down? No, he's still there. He's got 25 health. He's got 31 block. Right, I need to try and get these bombs out. Can I bomb and heal? If I can, we might even knock some of this damage in as well. Yes, we did. Good. So boost, boost, boost. Okay, he's down. And we got 100 health again. Oh, that's good. Right, what shall we do here? Increase our health by 20 or increase the amount of items that can get dropped into the machine by 10. That sounds fun. Um, I think we've got to go to the blacksmith, right? Upgrade our stuff. So blacksmith. I think upgrade our wand. Um, oh, the armor. Gain 10 block at the start of every turn. I didn't realize it was every turn. Okay, maybe we'll upgrade the armor. Upgrade the sickle. Yeah, both of them. And then upgrade this hammer as well. Yeah, why not? All right, then do we want to get rid of any of these? Maybe the water pistol, 13 quid. I don't think we've ever used it, so it's gone. It's gone. More space for good stuff. All right, then up here, we got another battle. And we got a lot of gold items now. I'm feeling reasonably confident. All right, so then do we want to fill the machine with water? Just so it separates the metal and the floaty wood things. I think, yes. Let's do that. We'll then go down so we can get to the pachinko machine. It's a hard battle to get there, though. Oh, this guy's doing lots of attacks. And he's got 71 health. So we don't really have enough block to stop this. I mean, that gets doubled. That's actually very handy. And if we get the other one... That means we dodge his as well, right? Yeah, that's, so that's full on dodging. As long as it goes in. Yes, it went in. It went in. Okay, we dodge all the attacks this turn. Um, I'll try and get those knuckles. Oh, we got double knuckles again, boy. All right, and then if we just go like there-ish, that should magnetize a lot of stuff. Yeah, all the daggers are stuck to us. Okay, that should be enough to take out the first one. Maybe the second guy as well. No, not quite. He's got 25 health. But all the dodges means he can't get to us. And he hurt himself. Um, oh, we got a rare tower shield. Increased block by 20. Yeah, we'll take one of those. All right, then we'll go gamble. So what's in there? A dark sword. Oh, I don't want a dark sword. I can re-roll though. It's the hand of Midas. All right, just drop it down the middle. Hopefully we can get it. Yes, we got it. Hand of Midas. Yes, please. And yes, we've unlocked garbage, Greg. Oh, I don't think that was for the coins, actually. I think that was for having like so many items on us. I wonder if we need 500 coins like in total or just like on us uh, let's add a piggy bank for some extra coins and then take on lord squidula so he's got 451 health Damn! I think, can we get those two gold weapons no we got a shield cheers game appreciate that all right then we'll go like there-ish to grab all of that stuff oh the sickle didn't quite fall in <laughs> we only did 10 damage 
Pathetic. Oh no, he's doing he's doing five attacks of nine damage each. Each attack is applying poison and he's healing after every attack. Great. Okay, we need some dodges then. So grab that dodge. Knock the sickle in as well. Thank you. All right, then really we need we need the other the other brass knuckles, but the shield was in the way, stupid shield. So we are going to take some damage. We've only got five block on us. So ow, 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 ow. We took a lot of damage. All right, at least he's not doing any attack this turn. Gives us a chance to do some good attack. Hopefully with all these gold weapons, we should be good. Yeah, his health's going down quite rapidly now. He's got 150 health remaining. And this is where we really need to hurt him. So if I can get these, maybe I could just about sneak the healing thing. No, we got one sickle, but it will count as double, remember? So boosh, boosh. With the crit, he's down to 78 health. We could finish this if we get lucky. I think I need brass knuckles, so let's go there. Okay, we got the brass knuckles at least. We're doing quite a bit of damage. We might be good. Yes, yes, he's down. Yes, he's down. We got full health. Decent, right. Let's take critical hit chance by 10%. I don't think I'm too fussed on the shredder. All right, and now before we go to the next room, we can go to these two rooms. So we got a mystery room down here. The one that I really shouldn't go to, but I can't help myself. Oh, so much damage, but so many coins. <laughs> We're down to 60 health. Hopefully over here, though, we can heal ourselves. I just need four of these. I mean, I can probably get three there. Yeah, decent. That's not bad. All right, and then up here, I think we want to go to the blacksmith. So let's upgrade the hand of Midas. So that's a large area will turn into gold. We can make the piggy bank gold as well to get even more coins. And then maybe make this. It's 46 coins to upgrade. I think it's worth it though. What is that? Is that a beehive riding a unicycle? Fair enough. Yeah, we could actually re-roll. I mean, a sickle is good, but I wouldn't mind some like rarer stuff. Our oh, re-rolls cost more every time. All right, one more re-roll. Oh, here we go. We could get a healing flask. Not going to complain about that. I am going to complain about that, though, because I completely got nothing there. Maybe if we go there, can we get the brass knuckles as well? Not quite. We should, as long as they fall in. Yes, we should get some block. So that guy only hurts us for a tiny bit of damage. And now we can try and finish this double sickle hit. Boosh, boosh. He's got one health. Let's try and get rid of the health while doing some getting some coins decent all right we can then grab the oh the amulet of strength increases your strength by five yes please they really want me to take on mathilda but no i'm going for this guy goobert the king of slimes so before we do let's see what we get in here yes it's healing i'm so glad it's healing all right do i try and get a pig as well or do i just try and get healing i mean could be a gamble okay we should heal to almost max health i think do we have 95 health now yeah there we go so we can then take down this boss. 636 health. I should have taken on Mathilda. I think though, I'm going to try and get this magnet for next turn, at least with the claw. Is, is that going to double or is it just attacks that double? No, it has doubled. So next time we're going to have crazy amount of magnets to use. This time, just want to make sure we get the brass knuckles. Phew, we're good. We're good. So we dodge his attack. And then this next turn, do we have three magnets? That's what we'll have to find out. Oh, what's he going to do? Summon a minion? Oh, no. Okay, so we want to do damage if we can. Can we get these two gold weapons? Yes. So he's down to 532 health. No, we only get one magnet. That's annoying. Anyway, we'll then grab all of that stuff. And then all of that stuff. Unfortunately, those two didn't fall in. But he's down to 460 health. But this guy's been spawned. Ugh. Anyway, good grab with the claw. We knocked a coin in as well. We should dodge all the attacks. And then if we go like there, that should take out the mushroom. And then maybe the guy behind. We got a ring as well. So we got decent strength now. So the longer we go on, the more powerful we become. And if we go over here, we may be able to do enough damage. Depending on the crits. Yes, we got lucky with the crits. Right. Oh, Vampire Fangs, you regenerate one health when you deal damage. That's incredible. Or we can start each fight with 15 block. Or we can heal for eight if we kill an enemy with a critical hit. Oh, they're all really good. I th think crits is probably the way to go because we got a few other critical things. All right, we'll then go the bottom route, I think, just because I know we've got a free alchemist thing. So it means we can make one of these... Like the amulet of strength. We can make that metal, which will really, really help. 
And then I'll probably spend some money making this magic wand metal because that heals me. I mean, maybe the healing flask as well. Yeah, do it. <laughs> Everything's metal. I mean, I can then upgrade the healing flask so we heal for 15. That seems worth it. Amulet costs 58, so I can't afford that. I can make these brass knuckles better ones though, which is a good idea. All right, then we got another battle. We're on floor 19 out of 20, by the way. So this is coming towards the end. Feels like a good build, but there have been moments where it hasn't gone great. But fingers crossed we can make it. Um, I need I need some block. I need a lot of block and a lot of damage. Yeah, let's try up this end. If we can get those knuckles and a few of these weapons. Oh, of course the knuckles didn't go in. Cheers, knuckles. Okay, we're going to take a lot of damage here. Whoa, we're down to 63. Anyway, let's go there. If we can get the healing as well, we are laughing. Yep. Ha 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 ha. We are laughing. That front guy should be down. Decent. This guy's going to reflect. So I need a dodge first. So we've got the dodge. Hopefully it drops before any damage. Yes, I think we're good. I think we're good. Okay, and then we got the squid tentacles. So I've got dodge. So we just want to go for damage. I mean, let's let's get the coins as well. So we got coins. We got the ring. So we got strength. We got quite a lot of attack damage there. Yeah, first guy's down. Second guy's going to be down very soon. So boosh, one hit and he's down. Uh, might re-roll these. Try to get something a bit better. Let's grab a spiky shield. Then, oh no, then we can go to the blacksmith. We've only got 30 quid though. Okay, let's get some coins from this battle first. Anyway, we'll take the battle axe there and then we'll go back to the blacksmith. Upgrade the battle axe so it's gold. Upgrade the spiky shield so it's gold. That's all my coins gone. And then in here we have the final boss. So I think let's just go for it. So who is this? Squallow the lone fishetti. <laughs> it's a lone shark. It's got 1100 health. Okay, so we just want to go all out attack. I mean, maybe worth trying to get the magnet thing. So I've got another go next turn. Have we got it? Yep. A little bit of attack, a little bit of magnet for next turn. And this turn, we can just go there, get the amulet. An early amulet means more strength, more damage next turn. So nice. He's still got over a thousand health though. Not great. And what's going on? So he's going to do three attacks of 14. And then down here, he adds one strength for each coin I collect. Okay, so we really need to dodge. Oh no, and he's added piggy banks everywhere. <laughs> oh no. Okay, so we need we need dodges basically. So there's two dodges. And then we got two magnets now. So we're sort of okay, I think. Because we've got the other dodge in the bag. So now we can't get hurt. So it doesn't matter how many coins we collect. Um, I might go this end, actually. Get the amulet again, just to try and increase our strength. I feel like we might need it. Oh, the amulet fell out. Stupid amulet. Right, so we dodge all of his attacks. He's down to 800 health now. We've only got to dodge one attack. So let's try and get that one. This is all about the brass knuckles, this. All right, nice. And then we go there just to grab all of that metal stuff. And then boosh, 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 boosh. He's down to 575 health halfway. All right, and this is one just to go all out attack. So that's not a bad grab. And then we'll go there-ish for the amulet and some of the other stuff. Although the amulet's not going to fall in again. Damn you, amulet. Why is it evading me? Oh no, he's added spikes. He's added spikes. Okay, let's try and get the brass knuckles and not a spike. Okay, we got one spike. We did heal ourselves. As long as we get the heal after the spike. Oops, we got it before. Right, oh man, he does 35 damage three times. And remember, we've got We've got the strength. So I need I need dodge hit. Oh, we might be in trouble. We might be in trouble. Unless I can somehow do 196 damage. No, we are we are in a bad way. We are in a bad way. Let's try and get the knuckles just so we dodge some. Please, knuckles. Oh no. Oh no. Could we we might die here? I think we're dead. I think we're brown bread. Oh no, we're good. Wait, why did he hurt himself? Two of his attacks didn't actually hit me, and they hurt himself. Shut up, Matt. Don't complain. Just take just take it. Just take it. Right, we got the heel. We got the heel. We got the brass knuckles. He's down. <laughs> we got so lucky at the end there. <laughs> nice. So now, have we unlocked who we wanted to unlock Bernie? No, we do actually need 500 coins in one go. Like, without spending them. Still, we did unlock Garbage Greg. For now, I'll say peace, love. And there may be a skin coming for this guy that you guys might be interested in. So make sure you watch future videos. Bye.